My wife and I always wanted lots of kids. I mean, we always laughed. We played paintball a lot. We said, let's, you know, let's have enough kids to have a paintball team. When we started having kids and got married, we had two kids, we uh, lost a third one, and we decided at that point, let's just adopt. My wife found uh, these kids on a video on Huffington Post, and they were three, a, three, a set of three children, uh, 13, 10, and seven. Um, they were looking for a forever home, is what they call it. Uh, someone to foster and adopt them. One of the first rules they teach you is don't look on the internet. They're all cute, you know? And um, I looked on the internet and I came across, first I just came across a picture and I uh, showed it to my husband and my boys and they were like, when do they come? Hi, my name is Layla Walker. I'm 14 and I'm in eighth grade. So Layla, her predominant um, sense that she uses to see the world and to learn is touch. Robo 3D has been in my house for over a year. When, it, when she came in and I said, let's, let's, let's print something, let's do something. What do you like? What do you want to do? At the time, she was into school buses. So the first step was understand getting a printer something she liked. Starting with just so she understands the concept of this is, I can make this and then she can have it. Um, and then the next step was every time she came home from school, we had a huge problem with fractions. And so with her, you know, I said, I, you know, first I went online, first thing, I said, well, let's go to the teaching store and see if we can find, let's order something. Let's order a fraction this or a fraction that. And they're all visual. They're not anything to do with what you would want. You know, they're, they're flat pieces of paper with, with pizzas on them. That doesn't help at all. And then, you know, lo and behold, my mind clicked and I said, oh, well, I'll just make one. And so, you know, I went up to my printer and I said, oh, you know, I searched a little bit on the web and they said, oh, look, fractions, great. And so I started printing little pieces of pie and, and saying, hey, let's, and then I brought them down to her and say, this is a third, this is a sixth. Because in her mind, she thought a sixth was bigger than a third because the number's bigger. That's, you know, what you would think, right? It's like, oh no, this, and so then she feels, oh, this is this and this is this. And in her hand, she can feel the difference in size. She's like, oh, I get it. The 3D printer helps me learn because I can feel it, feel stuff. And when I feel things, it can pop right into my brain like a, like a, I don't know what you call it. My fingers are kind of like my eyes. It's pretty cool. Layla gets empowered by 3D printer, by Robo 3D, having the ability to show people things. She likes to be a teacher. That's her thing. She loves to teach people, even though she may not know it yet, and so she can take what you say and parrot it back to anybody. If I give her the, I give her a shape of California, she'll go try to teach her younger siblings, this is California, this is this. And so it makes her feel independent, so that she can feel helpful, and she can see all the different things that, you know, transferred from me to her to everyone else. We've been able to create things for her and watch all those pieces kind of fall into place. You know, see the understanding and see her be able to use that knowledge. And it's so exciting, you know, because she gets so happy and so excited to learn. The 3D printer is awesome. And when my dad prints stuff, I can feel it. Like right now, I have a cupcake in my hands. Feels cool.